Yep. Oh, did they fly away? Oh my goodness. It's crazy on how windy it is out there. Yep. Windy as shit. <laughs> How you doing? Did you get there? The joy is right. <clears throat> I'm actually debating if I'm going to try making your rails off of the factory seats work on the aftermarket ones. Just so you still have the option of going up and down. Oh, that would be cool. Get it? Get it. Oh, yeah, Hercules. Sherman, 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 Hercules, Hercules. Oh, that's nice. That's nice, Sherman. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to take a look at what it looks like under there. How flat is Oh, this would be super easy. Really not. No, this one would be actually quite easy. It's just that one. This one's manual. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying the floor is so flat. It's oh, actually yeah. not hard to do this one. <laughs> yeah, so the one bolt, you see it right here, that bolt going into the side there. Oh, the hidden one? The hidden one. So Sarah's ripping apart her factory seats because I kind of want to make it original in a way. I want to see racing seats in a car and work like the factory seats. That's why we're doing what we're doing. Her, go to work. Get it, girl. Get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it, get it. These guys are lucky to not see what I'm doing behind the camera. But <laughs> so yeah, so basically, we do have rails for it, but I think it'd be kind of cool if we can make everything work the way it's supposed to work, right? Yeah, that's high end. Five foot foot. That is the biggest problem, is <laughs> she's four and two. Hey, <laughs> she's, I'd be rich if I was that <laughs> She's 5'1", and the problem is she needs a booster seat. <clears throat> Do you need, did you ever need to have a booster seat under this? No, I did not. <laughs> uh, so we're going to... It's a phone book, get it right. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so we're going to try using her factory seat rails with the motors and everything to work the way it's supposed to, so the seat can go down, can go up, forward, back, tilt, go shebang. And that's why I want to see if I can modify these to the new seat. Not tilt. Just up and no, down the you, you don't have... My tilt is manual. No, but you can't tilt the front of the seat up because you can lift the whole seat up. But you... It just goes up and down front of the seat. Hyundai's pathetically <laughs> cheap. <laughs> Are you sure? I am positive. Here's the button for you. We get the, the button don't, yeah, see? So you can bring it in the front and bring that top, or you pull the whole thing up and it goes up. So yeah, you do have it. Oh, well, it never works. Wow, we're making it work, so. <laughs> we're gonna make everything work, no. I was curious if we should take the heating pads out of this or not. Where are they? Get it, girl. Get it, get it, get it, girl. See, so you do have the original heat one. Mm-hmm. You know, I could probably make that work with the new ones. Don't tell me these things. I would have to see how that one comes apart. Because then I would just have to throw it in. Those are sway? Yes. The only thing is, these are not holy. But yeah, I, well, I'm not tearing holes in those. No, 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 you're not. So for the heat to escape, there's holes in it. But, uh, I can't remember the name of them. And it has kind of a fire bag on it. See? So it's kind of a hot heated fire bag. Oh, but yeah. all I do is I take it all off of this seat, tear your seat apart, and put this, this, and then this is the actual heating pad here. Sounds like a lot. Oh. Sounds totally custom. Unnecessary work that I don't care for heated seats. You don't care for heated seats? It's not like I drive it in the winter. Are you hey, look at his feet. Look at his feet. 
Are you ever gonna take this thing off? Are you ever? Uh, get, get it, it get it, girl. Get it, get it, get it, girl. Get it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, go back to your your doll over there. I, I'm gonna get it done, but I'm waiting for you to get yours done. I'm about to light it on fire here. <laughs> I've been dealing with this nightmare all day. 2008 Suburban. Uh, customer thought it was a rear mainsail, but it was just oil pan gasket. So anyway, we took it out, cleaned it all up, put a new gasket in. We had to remove the front diff, string rack, and the sway bar to get it out, and the uh, cross member. What? Actually takes the time to individually package. Oh my Jumbo with us? Ri the rim rivets. Who actually takes the time to individually wrap these things? <laughs> like, because you sell them separately. Yeah, but like, <laughs> somebody has time, and you know what, whoever always, did it could probably do it in a lickety split They only time. sell a pack <laughs> of fifty or a hundred. So what do you got there? I have a hundred in total, but I'm saying. Why individually pack them? <laughs> because they sell them, like if you lost one, they would sell you just one. No, they wouldn't, because they only sell them in 50s. Well, yeah, hundreds. but because we're a company, we're supposed to have bulk. So that's co considered bulk. I did not get it through the company though. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? So we wanted to kind of sit where the factory seat was. Realistically, actually, yeah, because that's where the back support would be. So, so we'll just cut these off. Both sides we'll probably trim this down flat. This piece here. Yeah, uh, it's gonna be iffy on that one, but we'll get it. And then it should be just pretty basic mounts. Can I cut these off too, or? Yeah, we'll cut those off, make it look nicer. Realistically, don't have to, but we will. Because that's where the uh, back, back piece goes. Okay. That piece there. So, if we put the chair all the way back there, then you're gonna be really short. <laughs> yeah. It'll be for big and tall only. And that's not good. Make it decorate for your car. Oh my god. No, I think it'd oh be funny. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it would be. be nice. <laughs> Alright, so where's your seat part? Your bottom of your seat there. Over there. Way over there. Okay, I'll get the line ready. So we had to move the cars around so it's a little bit better. But uh, look at Sarah. That is uh, very less work needed. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, so time to chop it chop. Okay, so. I'll just show you how much I use. 
use it. <laughs> All right, so that's hooked up. Now we'll put the seed in and uh, see. It's fine. Holy cow, that's purple. Very purple. Very, very purple. Everyone got their sunglasses on? Right. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna make sure this is flat. The bolt holes the same where they need to be. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a thing right now to hold the seat. Yep. Don't touch it. Don't touch it until I get a bracket on. Usually when it's already installed, then you can. But don't, don't. Sarah, I swear if you screw up the measurements, I'm gonna put it on the way it is and you can deal with their hip problems. And, hey, stop it. Go upstairs. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, women. Look how sparkly this thing. Sarah, stop touching the damn seat. You are definitely your child. I think you did mess up with it. I didn't even move it. Uh, I think you did. I did it. It didn't even move. I think you did. You messed it up. Stop touching the suit, Gary. All right, so we're gonna, I think I'm gonna do a kind of a L bracket style here. And something there. So I'm gonna go a little heavier on the metal just because it's better. Huh? Well, no, I'm going heavier metal, metal for safety wise. <laughs> All right, so some of you are probably like, why are you doing it this way? Um, Sarah's only 4'1", 4'2", so she's not a very high girl, or tall girl, I should say. And, uh, you know, if I set it up to where she is, uh, I can see issues down the road if I wanted to say, if I wanted to drive it or let's say it goes to another mechanic or whatever, uh, somebody will be able to adjust it. So basically, everything is gonna work the way it's supposed to. The front will go up, the front will go down, the back will go up. So it kind of gives you that choice to tilt a little bit. And that's one thing about racing seats is you can't get a tilt out of it because they're solid back. But with something like this, you can tilt it because I left the base. So <clears throat> making it work like this, in my eyes, makes more sense. Now the passenger side doesn't really matter. Of course, we want to bring it up to a decent height, uh, but also think about somebody that is a little bit taller. Now these are extra large seats. So they're kind of big for her anyway, but she's gonna be fine. Once the pillow is in there, it's gonna kick her up. But this seat, I've already tested, it goes all the way up. So you can see I welded a L bracket here. Now my biggest concern is this was a two piece system, bracket trees. So this whole bottom base, I have to make sure is strong to withstand the person's weight going tilted and everything. I made that bracket and that bracket. What? Grab your yeah, grab your pillows. Okay. Might have to get a double stacker for you. <laughs> you might have to grab me a phone book. A Chinese phone book? Why would they put this in the back? Uh, you probably could, but. I, I hate my legs being lifted. Yeah, but they're little pockets. <laughs> yeah, I don't use them. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Does it feel comfortable? Where's your steering wheel? It's really comfortable. Oh, what's going over here? What are you? Bow Wow from Tokyo Drift? I don't sit this far back, bang. No, but I need to know where we're at. Okay, so I'm gonna hook up the power. See, now if 
My and legs were a little longer. <laughs> All right, so let's hook this up quick. Oh, so we'll give her some power. Show the peeps. So, nice. because your button's not on right now. Oh, I see, I see. And then this is like your down and up. Because you have it all unscrewed. Wow, look at that. No Genesis has that. Power racing seats. Put your steering wheel. Is that where your steering wheel sits? No, that's as low as it goes. Yeah, I can't do that. You can't drive a school bus. Okay, watch your arm closing. Oh. Holy cow, you can see the fedazzleness. Oh, oh my God. goodness. The steering wheel and the seat, you can see the fedazzleness. <laughs> God, you sit so close to the wheel. I have to. I know, you're so small. See it's what not, I have to deal not, with, guys? <laughs> okay, so yeah, you know, you're good. You're good. Okay, so am I gonna continue building this seat like this, or if... we'll fix that after? But am I continue building this to the racing yeah, seat? I would well, rather it move than me being solid. You're, you're gonna be the only ready. person in the world that has it's that. Like, hey guys, hang on, let me just get out. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Does your racing no, mine don't. Well, mine does. Factory ones from Evo and all that, they do, but those are no fun. This is at least lightweight <laughs> with a heavy track. Ow! All right. So. Now I can tell people they want to drive my car and just be like, no, you can't. No, but <laughs> you, we still can, because realistically. But I'm going to tell them they can't, because they don't know that. Oh, well, care. I built it, so they're going to know. Yeah. Am I dirty? No, you're fine. It's already dirty. From so Sarah is covering the seat because I'm dirty. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see if I can do this. I believe in you. Okay. It's pretty comfy, actually. It is. I wish it would go lower. I mean, I'm a, I'm a tall guy. Is that as far back it goes to? Yeah. <laughs> but I mean... It's tolerable. It's you can tolerate it, but can't you? I think you? when your, your original seats were in here, my hair still touched the roof. Yeah, like right now, it did. Yeah. Yes. yeah so. And I mean, these should be a little bit. And it was bad because the uh, original seat with the back seat, it always pushed your head forward. That's yeah, what drove me nuts so about much. it. This one is way comfier. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's that's super good. I like that. That's. Impact performance though. Yay, yay! Yay, yay! <laughs> Sarah's getting crazy with it, boys and girls. Very Pacific. Persona. It's the OCD. It's the OCD. So she's doing this because she had some. Uh, Quite a bit of heat coming through that hit, their hole. So we got that, she bought that, and then she bought this uh, to go over that hole because with the Genesis, the reason one wouldn't fit, right? Mm -hmm. So that's where we're at right now. I'm still one of these. Mm. Does it look terrible? Well, realistically, it didn't have to be as pretty as you got it because it's kind of hidden but i love that you're so dedicated i actually did, i only use like two patches here that's it yeah, so you got I a only, shit ton still look I at how much she has in the back of the car <laughs> oh my goodness i literally took yeah so i measured it from here to here and then i cut out one big piece and i literally just chopped it in half used it like it literally went edge to edge no oh, perfect one catch, two catch, and then I just crumbled a couple of gears and that was about it. <laughs> the side of that seat is sparkly as hell. I oh know, my right? goodness. Shabang, shabang. The camera's not even justice. Like, it's brighter <laughs> in my eyes right now than the camera. 
So we gotta what, finish up that seat, get the other seat ready. But thank God I didn't put that seat in yet because you'd be sitting down doing that in an uncomfortable way. Yep. Turned in well, an uncomfortable way. And then after this, I'll probably stick my center console in. You wanna put the, yeah, put the center console in, see how it fits. <laughs> gotta try it out and find out, right? Mm. Might take the seat out and then do it, and then take the seat out. I gotta finish up the seat anyway. I gotta finish the oh, yeah. brackets on that side. So, and we gotta put those bolts back into the slider up and down part. Yeah. yeah gotta put those uh, those bolts back in. So. Woo! Getting closer and closer. Are you watching TV while you're doing this? Yep. Oh God, this face looks like he's farting. Hey. Oh God. All right, well, I'm just ceramic coating my unit because uh, I'm tired of cleaning black, so I hate black. I, I love black, but I hate black. So I washed it. I ceramic coated the roof and the, the door, but I gotta do the rest of it, so. You getting ribs? You getting ribs? You're supposed to be working. No, I didn't look. Big old fat rib skis. Look at the mess. Looks like a rat was here. Yeah, that looks good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that looks way better. Yeah, that should make a difference. Well, you said it, so now I'm gonna put it up on the No. Yeah. No. We do soundproofing, vetting in, and uh, heat proofing. Look at you just chow down, Jesus. This is really hard. Is it? Should be fall off the bone. <laughs>